Yo, what's poppin' people? Welcome back to another video. Thank you guys so much for the support. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell and also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. I'm with my boy Fletcher. You guys have not oh, seen Fletcher going on, guys. in a hot second. If you guys want to check out his channel, be sure to do so. I know we got <laughs> together when my parents came down and we had a good time, went fishing. So we're back out it again today. He's in town and um, we're going to go do some fun fishing. We actually got the John boat on deck today and we're gonna be trying to catch some big bass on some big jigs today let that's me always tell fun. you guys these fish have been munching let me show you what uh noah's gonna be throwing over here today what'd, where'd you tie that bad boy it's up? right there this jig right here this black and blue jig as you can see the water here behind us is really stained right now so what you want to do is throw something that has some contrast in the water so that dark black and blue jig those fish can really hone in on it when the water's really murky and all these fish right now are positioned on some offshore structure it's blazing hot it's the heat of the summer right now those dog days you know how hot it gets and those fish get dormant so right now they are locked out on this deep structure and the other day i was just plucking off three and four pounders like it was nothing i'm gonna tell you bro <laughs> with this sun today too you know there's gonna be a good lay down bite too skipping Ooh. over those under uh, those yes, over hands you know that jig's gonna be a freaking key player this is actually a hybrid jig by six cents if you guys want to get a discount you can use my code i'll pop it up on the screen but we're gonna have some fun today it's gonna yes, be a good sir. day this spot literally right here let's see if i can get one on this cast there's these bluegill beds right here and i cast it here the other day and this fish was just staged off the edge of this waiting for these bluegills to come off bed for an easy little munch let's see if we can get them today maybe not but... look at all this bluegill man there's a ton of them i don't know if you guys can see it in the water yeah, dude, if we can get on that skip bite, we, we filmed a good couple videos of that skip bite, and that is some of the most fun yes, you'll have. Sir. Well, we're going to go ahead and hop into this video and go catch some big fish. I'm excited about it. We're going to have a good day today. Super hot, but it's going to be fun. You guys better stay tuned. Hit that like button. Go check out Fletcher's channel. Let's hop right into it. Well, Fletcher is talking to the camera, rigging up some stuff. I'm actually going to walk down this bank, do a little bit of bank fishing for a minute. And uh, see maybe if we can hook one over here. There's been a bunch of fish that usually stack up on this side. Um, so we might end up hooking, <laughs> hooking a big one before we even get out on the water. Like I said, just a little basic hybrid jig, black and blue. Um, I think it's really going to, oh man, it's going to get it done today. Conditions, like I said, really sunny. There's really no, um, really no cloud, or there is some clouds over there. But for the most part, the sun is beating down. So I'm going to tell you, man, this, uh, this bottom bite today is going to be really good, and I'm excited about that. Um, that on the, those overhangs and those laydowns, like skipping up under those trees, that's going to be a lot of fun today. So <laughs> I'm excited about that. The offshore bite, that's what we're going to start off on, and then we're going to go, you know, probably pitch some laydowns and try to find some of those holes that those fish are sitting in. I think it's going to be really good. That's the thing. These hot summer days, it can be tough, but if you get the right bait and you fish some of the right cover, um, it can be deadly this time of year. <laughs> Let's see if we can hook one real quick. Alrighty, didn't get a bite. I think it's time. No, I thought I was gonna catch one as you were rigging up, but I tried. I tried, I think the offshore a little bit of offshore bite right now is gonna be gonna be good. Whoa, hold up. Got us a little lay down right here. You think there's a Karen hanging out in there? Maybe. Maybe a big stanky girl at the end of it. Maybe not. I don't know. I think there's a like you were saying, that offshore bite right off the beginning is gonna be really good. Yeah, I think they're gonna eat it really good. Have some nice double ups. Yes. Let's get it started, Fletch. Yes, Tired of talking. Okay. Are you ready? Look at these bluegills, guys. I don't know if you guys can see it on the GoPro. There's a up. bunch of will guys. Yeah, it's That's gonna be like a fast candy right there. It's actually gonna be a full moon tomorrow. Alright, it's time to hit it, guys. Whoop. We are off. Whoop. I'm ready. The water's actually not that bad. What do you say? It's not that bad. The heat? No, the water. Not too bad, is it? That's pretty green. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is it's a little. Green. It's 
It's not as clear as it usually is. I did not snap that off today. Bro. I know, dude. <laughs> I, I can't hook set high I usually do. By the way, guys, I was a dingleberry this morning and I somehow forgot my rods and reels. That was the first, but <laughs> I actually literally think that's the first. I don't think I've ever forgot my rods and reels. There's always something you forget. Yeah, dude, that was that was just the dumb one. I fished a tournament yesterday and I like put them inside. They're usually in my truck and I got about 10 minutes from Fletcher's house and I was like, I called him. I said, we got a problem here. I totally forgot my rods and reels. So I am using a mock crush on a mock smash. Very interesting, Fletcher. Very interesting. You know, I wouldn't have that problem if it wasn't for um, somebody snapping my rod. What rod? I wonder, oh, oh. I wonder, I wonder who could have snapped my rod. Uh, <laughs> what route are you talking about, man? I think a couple million people remember that one. <laughs> I think that thing's at like five million views. <laughs> oh my God. All right, well, we're gonna start off right now, guys, fishing some offshore, really big, chunky pipes. Big, no, chunky, well, this one's a brush pile. This one's a big brush pile right there's here. There's big, chunky pipes over there and over there, and that's what's probably gonna be some sauce. It's right, right there, correct? Yeah, like we're literally cast straight out. Okay. It's time to fire this bad boy out here. No, it's throwing a big old black and blue jig. Oh, oh no! Took me right you were reeling it in? It snapped me off. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my gosh. I don't know what wow. snapped right there. I, I checked that not really good. It just grabbed me coming right up to the boat right there. It must have been falling it up off the bottom. I told you not to eat that dang banana, Fletcher. <laughs> we were in the gas station, you grabbed a banana. I was like, oh, is here's that, a bad, bad luck banana. Uh oh. Feel it? I got a fish. That one? Yeah. Yes, sir. Decent one? Oh, man. Oh, yeah. That is a tank. That's a nice Bear, one. Dude, he just loaded up on it. Don't jump, baby. Don't Do you even jump. Feel like bite it? No, just load it up. Don't jump, baby. Oh my gosh. What a fish to start off the day right here. Oh, oh baby. We just wearing her out. Got her on this lighter rod. And I knew she was she gonna do it. it. I knew she was gonna do it. That was a good fish though. That was a solid what? Three pounder? That, that was, was solid, solid three. A solid three pounder. She like it was weird because usually, you know, they thump it, just load it up. Cause you know how I was like, bites right there. I was like, Ugh. she had it a good second before I hook set. I, I had it in my head. I was like, this has to be a fish. But at the same time, I was like, I might be going over that stuff, but just solid weight. That was interesting. Hmm. That was a weird bite. Never felt or hit it. Find a few more on this pile. If not, we got a few more to fish. I'm in it right now. Oh yeah. No. Oh. Ooh, no. Ooh. God. Oh, he just got me. Oh no, Ooh. dude. That one I felt right when I brought it over the branch, dude. Just plunk. Yeah, right when I was creeping over the branch, she grabbed it. She just didn't have it all the way. I got a little too excited. When you guys get me on a jig bite, I just get. Hey, the nerves are go through the roof. Look at that, son. Oh my God, pulled the whole thing down. Look at that. Just a little piece of that curl left. Little tiny piece. Dang, she must have just had it like bunched on the, on the tail end of it. Just no hook in her mouth. I ain't gonna lie, I need to retire already. Really? Right and this that? is the last jig, by the way. Uh, this is Fletcher's little hybrid jig. It's the only one we got today. I ran out of my black and blues. So I got one in the boat, I'm pretty sure, and that's it. So I've really gotta, I've gotta play count. careful on this. I, I did hook set that fish a little Noah hook setty. <laughs> I need to uh, slow that one down a little bit. Okay, we're gonna, this ain't the first time I've been in Fletcher's crawl bin. A million different crawls. Only a million different flavors. Do you ever, when you're younger, go like, to the candy shop and just throw you know, everything in a bag? Yeah. Or like, you ever do a suicide drink where you take a cup like at a where there's like a fountain drink and just a little bit of every. Do you ever <laughs> bro, do that as a kid? bro, the McDonald's <laughs> high C, bro. I, I don't remember. I think I would mix the McDonald's high C's, bro. That was some good here we go uh oh here we go right uh -oh. The boat. oh oh no that's a good one Fletch. <laughs> Munched it right up underneath oh that's a really good one you want me to help you you got it i think i got her good yeah. i think i definitely got Stuck a good her. hook in her 
It's almost here, a three baby. pound. That might be a that is a three pounder. What am I saying? Check that out, guys. She inhaled that thing, as you can see right there. Got a nice hook set in her. Right in the thick part of her mouth, too. That sucker was not going anywhere. But she munched it right underneath the boat. Both of my bites so far have come like right up underneath us. Might need to back off a little bit. <laughs> I know, for real. Like, I don't know if they're following us. I don't, in or they're just positioned off of it. Yeah, I, I'm not really sure because both of yours kind of came on the far end of it and mine came on this side of it. But I don't think it comes out this far. Could be wrong, but that is a great fish. Probably a high two. Yeah. High two. She's a little That's, skinny for a three. A little skinny. I thought she was when you flopped her in. But yeah, she's got... She got they always shrink, don't they? <laughs> they, they always do. They, when they come up and they flop, they always look a little bit bigger than they actually are. But definitely a quality fish. Great one to start the day. Let's go ahead and get this beautiful girl back in. Always appreciate the bite. Did I retie this? No, I did not. I didn't remember. All I remember is a hook set and a fish. <laughs> So guys, we're gonna tie a basic little uni knot. You guys already know. The old basics. It's had a little fray. And you guys know I always say you need to retie, and then most of the time I just ignore it. Ignore it and break it off and then tell you guys that you should retie when no one <laughs> ever reties, but we are retying today. Especially on this thin line because 15 pound with Noah, just let me tell you. Doesn't agree. It's like two pound. I, I don't know. It's weird. <laughs> it, it just. That, there's, there's two pounds really make a difference when you bump up to 17. Oh my god. It really does though. Alright. Let's see if we can get us another For one. For every inch you have on your arms, you gotta go up a pound. Shoo. <laughs> Shoo. Well, I, I've lost a good bit of inches, so maybe, maybe we're in a, a safe zone right now. This trailer just broke. I'm gonna hang my meat. Hanging your meat. That's what I call the hang my meat special. <laughs> I wish I had my rods because I would have brought out my big flipping rig, dude. Put us on the back we could have, oh my god, that would have been so much fun. What, punching that stuff? Punching all these, like th like getting up in the yeah. thick of it. What were you saying? You want me to position us on this side? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that. Might double up. Here, no. Yes, sir. All right, all right. That is a good one too, man. Double up. I try to keep this off. That's a good fish. Yes, sir. Oh gosh, Fletcher, that's a really that's good a nice one. one. You want me to help you? No, no, I got her. I think she's pinned good. She's pinned good. Oh, that's a really healthy fish. Oh my gosh. Dog. Hey, Fletcher. Double up. Fletcher. Yes. Oh. Yes. How's yours feel? It feels pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. Can it's hard to idea? tell. I don't know. I really don't. He's running at me now. Oh. <laughs> oh. Let's see what Noah's got. Oh, he's pulling the drag. What you think? It's about the same. About the same? Yeah. Like, he is tugging, dude. I'm just letting him fight on this rod. It's fun. Let me pluck this guy out of here. We're trying to stay off the cover out here. Noah's got himself a nice one. Thank you. I think you might have me beat. Or we got a pair of twins. Let's take a look at these guys. Oh, Ooh. I don't know. Mine might know. be a little bigger. I don't. I think yours is a little longer, but I think mine's a tad bit fatter. I don't know. They're close. <laughs> They're very close. You want to throw them on the scale? Yeah, we should. That would actually be kind of cool. Little... Heck yeah, we got the double up that we were wanting. Yes, sir. Fish bump. Fish bump. Boom. Ow. All right, guys. Look at that one. These are both. This one's three. I know. They're close to it. I'm. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I think I got you. I think you got me. I think you got me. I don't think mine's quite three. I'm saying like it's kind of mid thick. twos, high twos. This is a three pounder. Two eleven. Yeah, this this one might be dead on in three. There you go. All right, zeroed out. You said two eleven on that one. Let's see what this one is. It's either gonna be like a high two, like a two fourteen, two fifteen, or a three pounder. Three pounds even, three baby. Even. Look oh. at that three. <laughs> you got me beat by. Just like five, five ounces. ounces. But that is a solid little double up. I'll take that all day. <laughs> that was good. Roll. That was awesome. Splash. Look at that fish right there. That's a beautiful one. Three pounder. Yes, Three younder. Sir, baby. Let's go. Got a good double up. We might get another one. He was in the same spot yours was at too. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I threw it on that left hand side. That's a beautiful fish. There he goes. Heck yeah. First Woo! double up of the day. Give me something on that. Yes, sir. Let's Angle go. me the last. I promise you that. Told you, man. He's got to hang your meat. 
All right. He come off the chunk? Yeah. No, you got... Yawn? <laughs> hey, that's a big one. I ain't gonna lie, that's a big one. Oh, can we get another double? Yo, that, that... I, it, it, I'm gonna tell you right now, he's fighting twice, if not more, as hard as that last one. Really? Yeah. I don't know. He's running at me now. Dude, he feels... He, it might be this broad. Look at that. Dude, that thing is tugging. If that thing hasn't come up yet... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a four-pounder. That's a freaking stud. He hit it on the fall. I felt him. Is that a four? It's going to be close. Oh, my God. This rod, dude. This is actually fun, but it worries the mess I'm out sure of me. I'm sure we could get another you double, wanna... but I'm going to get the camera for you, bud. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing them out. I'm playing with the fish today. That's a good fish, bro. This rod, dude. Bending on this jig. It's a bendy boy. It's a bendy boy. I'm just wearing them out. I think he just came off. No, he didn't. Oh, yeah. Oh, That's baby. a three and a half. He ain't... I don't know if he's quiet for it. We'll weigh him. He's fat. He's just a filled out fish, man. Look at that, man. That's a beautiful one right there. Yeah, that's this bigger than the last one. She's more filled out. Three eight. What's your guess? I'm thinking. You got your hands on her. Three seven, three eight. Three seven, oh, three eight. Oh, oh. Three. Three ten. Three ten. Oh. Three ten. There you go. That's a good fish. I'm about to say she for ten more ounces. Let me tell you, that fish was fighting. I mean, that thing was tugging. The last one was pulling drag. That was a good freaking bass. Now we're going to get back in there, see if we can double up again. It was a lot of fun. That was next cast, hit the bottom. When you find them stacked on this offshore stuff in the summer, it's, it's unbeatable. You can't beat it. You can flip these trees all day, and you can catch them, but these spots replenish so many bass down there. Good three and a half. <laughs> She's ready to go. Good three and a half pounder. <laughs> these fish are strong, dude. These fish are strong. Well, guys, that was a back-to-back -back cast. Now Flusher's going to get in there and hook him Let's see if we can tell they are stacked on this guys i mean they've got these big pipes on the spot and then right where i just cast there's like i wouldn't call it pea gravel but it's really small gravel it's a little bit smaller we were catching them on this thick pipes a second ago i actually felt that one hit it on the fall mm -hmm. i threw it in there and i it felt i felt a little thump before it even hit the bottom before it hit i was about right there about where you're at i would tell you guys how i'm working it but that last one just hit the bottom i'm, I'm giving it a no. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Holy oh, cow. Yeah. Oh, whoa, wait, wait, wait. That's a fatty. Wait, Fletch. <laughs> you gonna get a look at him? Ooh. You want me to help you land it or film? <laughs> uh, take the camera. <laughs> Fletch is on with a fish, freaking guys. giant. Oh, this offshore Ooh. bite Ooh. is so fun. Stay down, baby. Stay down. That's a good one. I'm just dude. trying to keep us off the stuff so we can keep catching the fish and don't scare them off. She's hooked pretty good, though. Right there in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> let's go baby let's go let's go <laughs> they are loaded on that stuff that is dumb oh is it's dumb. just automatic man that's a another solid this one's three pounds all day thank you for bit, biting range okay she's just vibing <laughs> she's just vibing <laughs> let's go let's buddy go. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, god it feels good down there uh-oh throw in there yeah, throw in there. Yeah, oh gosh. Good in? <laughs> it's a pretty good one. Just double up. Oh, I want the double right now. Oh yeah, it's a three. Golly. These fish are fighting, dude, today. Which I'm surprised on a summer day like today. It's a three pounder. Come on, oh, Fletch. Hi. Come on, Karen. I know you're on here. Golly, these fish are strong. That's about a three pounder, a little short of three pounds. Find that same range, man. They're all footballs. And there's freaking fat and healthy, beautiful markings on this one. It's like a golden color. Barely had it in the corner of her mouth, but I guess I had her good. Yeah, about two and a half. Look at that beautiful colors. These, this, that's a gold bass. Look at that. Man, she's got some beautiful markings. Beautiful colors. Pretty one. Golly, munching that jig right there. Yeah. Oh, I got him. I got him in the tree. I got him out. Oh, man. Feel like a good one? Yeah, he's trying to get in that tree. Oh, he's still in there. This line's tough. Yeah, I got him. He's out. 
Ooh. Ooh, you dirty boy. Oh yeah, he spit it out a little quick release. <laughs> Woo! Yes. Oh no. my god, it didn't really snap. Are you... Oh uh -oh. no, he's cold. Uh-oh. Oh. He plunk you? You got him? Oh my god. Oh, Alright, he's stuck in there, but he feels actually really big. Hold he's on. still on. Hold on, I'll get you over there. Oh gosh, he's is that him? That is yeah, him. I think that was him. Wait. Did he come off? Wait. Yes. Yo, oh gosh, what? That's a nice one, bro. Look at the head on that. That's a beautiful fish right there. That's a good one. Alright, let's bring you around this side, girl. That's a good one. Look at that one. <laughs> That is awesome, guys. We almost had to double up. We were so close. That's actually a really big one. That might be the biggest today. Is it? I can't tell. She's she's a girthy one, man. Oh my god. She hooked good? I sure hope so, because that is <laughs> our fattest fish. Do you think she's four? Do you think we broke into the four pound range? She's fat, man. I don't know if she's long enough, man. Uh, nah. <sighs> you throw her on the scale. We'll throw her on the scale just to do it, but she's a solid three and three quarters, maybe. There's something that me and Brad, oh, you're running the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know. Um, I didn't even know you were running the camera. Now, me and Bradley have this thing where when I tell a fish to sit, it will sit. Sit. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm being serious. 311. So three Ooh. and three quarters, pretty much. Dang. One ounce away. That's a beautiful bass right there. That was a big girl. That is a big girl. Football, baby. Some boy. Yeah, we'll give you some on that one. Almost had another double up. That was a close one. Had this girl wrapped up all in there. She felt really good. It's a pancake. I haven't used that term in a while. That was I think, a pan. I think deserving of that title. That's a pancake. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Nuh-uh. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh. That was a nice Yo, one. that was like <laughs> the same time. Oh, yes, sir. Bro, that... that's what I was looking for. <laughs> <gasps> There's another one. Oh, is it really? <gasps> Dude, he's right there. Do you have another bait? Do you have another bait? Oh, I got the frog. <laughs> There's a crankbait. There's a crank in there. I don't know what I'm doing. Where'd he yeah, go? Hold it for Wait, do you actually? Do oh. you think we can make this happen? Let's see if you can get it. This see is getting a little crazy. Yo, there was two fit. I'm pretty sure there was two of them. Throw it in there, see if, it, see if there something will come up and eat it. Okay. Dude, they were right under the bass. I don't know where they went. That was wild, Fletcher. Oh my gosh, he's on the My bad. bad. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> I, if we had another, if we had another um, jig. jig or a soft plastic to put in there, oh my gosh. That would have been wild, but let's go ahead and get these two suckers up. I think I got you beat this time. Dude, what happened is my jig was sitting in front of the boat and all of a sudden it shot to the right, like five <laughs> foot. And I'm like, hold on. You probably heard me just stop talking. I was like, wait, <laughs> this is crazy. That Fish is bump it. Bow. Two nice bass. I think Mike's probably pushing about, probably close to two three. Two and a half. Two yeah, and a half. three. 